Yeah, they did make it home for Christmas. Good morning, everybody. I'm Omni Russell. Welcome back to... There ain't Stone Explorer. Welcome back to RimWorld. Looking at what we got right now. Um, I don't really want any of this. Let's go back into hygiene. I'm thinking deep wells might be a good idea. Watch larger area of groundwater. Because, like, water is becoming a huge problem. Oh, yeah, we wanted to look for atomic assembly, which is probably in the main list at the very, very end. AI persuasion? Excuse me? Reward signal system to persuade an existing AI persona core into serving as the ship's AI captain. Oh, that's one of the very end things. Pulse charged munition. Yeah, atomic assembly right there. Okay. Does anybody remember what I was going to do with this room? Because I just do not remember. And now every colonist of the male gender gets a psychic soothe pulse. It's nice. They were in such bad moods for so damn long. Inspired recruitment. If we had any prisoners, that would be pretty neat. You think it was a crafting room? I don't remember if it was a crafting room or not. I want to replace this with cotton again. Yeah, that's my best guess too, is I just, I just don't remember. I really don't. They are amazed by my hospitality and was visit again in a few days. So we got everybody back home now and everybody has slept. We still have an unowned bed. Oh, nope, that got taken up by Kakari the second I looked at it. Uh, yeah, we might have people without beds. So do we want to build over this way? For a new bedroom? Build down. I want it to be near this, but I don't want to build out this way. You know, I, I just, I don't remember. I don't remember what this was going to be. So instead, we will actually floor this up. Let's go ahead and go for some tile. Straight up marble tile. If I if I need it for anything else later, I can make it into something else later. Go down, you're thinking? I also don't want it to be too close to the edge of the map, but I do want to consolidate, like, my base a little bit more. And for when people wake up in the morning, I don't want them to run all the way over here to get to where they have to go for food, you know? But they'll be running up that much distance anyway, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. But we'll start the... We'll start our crafting room. Expand the current bedroom downwards. I guess I... No, I don't want to do that. Ah, I don't know. I guess I could. And I could also expand the... Uh, Power or garden and down it the same way as well. You know, that's actually not a bad idea. Okay, so we got this plumbing valve. Let's tar toggle it closed. It doesn't say whether these are irrigated or not. So, like, I don't know if I have to destroy the plumbing underneath it. Oh. Toggle it again. It does work that way. Okay. Interesting. I like that, actually. Alright, remove. Well, let's just keep that plumbing there, actually. Might as well, in case somebody destroys one of the plumbing on the outside. And then we will get plumbing like so. We irrigate up all of that. And we can actually switch it off. Uh, if we start running low on water, like we are. Oh my goodness. Temperature here is staying only at 10. That's not good enough. That is not good enough at all. Install here. A raccoon has self-tamed. Too bad for that raccoon. Where is it? God, we have so many animals. That is way too bad for that raccoon. And we have visitors from the kinship of the merciful Gosh, Goss Hawk. With a few items to trade.
There they are right there. Let's grab Kagari and go talk to Rotros. Rotros? Rotros? Let's call the whole thing off. I'm looking for one of them to sell all my nutrient paste to. <laughs> That's basically my plan. Uh, but it hasn't really happened yet. Uh, mostly we're just sending them home with sculptures and knives. Clubs. Yep. Um, I also need to remember that Huntress is going to get... Where is Huntress? There she is. Gonna get this sniper rifle. And let's get some more excellent statues in these rooms. Go. Nope, that one's already installed. I guess we're good there. Uh, the irrigation really, really upped the amount of food that we have. That is impressive. That is really impressive. Okay, so irrigation is almost set up? Oh, that's sort of opaque, so it's not completely set up yet. Um, and this means that we're going to have plenty of water pretty soon. It is storing very slowly. Uh, we seem to be using a lot of water, and that's still a big worry. We basically just need more powerful pumps, or really big pumps. Uh, they left 12 flake and an old-fashioned rifle. They just got here. Oh no, that was the visitor's uh, seaside townsfolk. Yeah, that's true. Okay. I don't have to worry about that. And it looks like our hospital is actually done. Uh, good time. Uh, a raid is here. Several separate groups of tribe people. So, several separate troops with sappers. Oh. Well, they're tribals. So that's bad. But they're sappers, so they're probably going to go through this wall here. Let's go get a firing group around this end. And we'll send Durkatan with them. For melee support. And everybody else... Huddle up here. Uh, maybe not. I mean, like, I don't even need to bring everybody... Just if I don't bring them, I feel like I'm going to be doing a disservice. Are there anybody else on the map? Yes, there is. Hello. Uh, get our firing squad into here. You know what? Actually, let's get these guys in a flanking maneuver firing squad. Yeah, these guys are... They, they might run into the traps, but we're basically having them fight here. Oh, I might have to pull them back. They're actually running into traps. Trying to take cover back there. Alright, there's one group fleeing. Good, we got them down. Oh, crap, Hunter just took a shot. I want to get Kagari in as well. Kagari, get inside. Uh, now that this is broken, we're going to bring Eevee with Durkatan providing cover. A meteorite! Oh god. Oh, it's way over there. I saw it here and I thought it was gonna like fall right on top of us. It is granite. I don't care. Alright, Faceless, get inside. Uh, Digger, fall back. Huntress here. I want to get Andrew, Dan, and Dusty in on this fight. They're very close right now. Eevee here, Durkatan here, just draw them in. And once enough of them are past this area, we're going to open up this. Although they appear to be getting through that granite door. Okay, uh, we need a melee. Casey. Hey, 
Open the door. All right, they open the door. It is not going well. Uh, we are completely uncovered. Hopefully, oh, we got to pull back. We got to fall back. Ow. Yeah, we got to fall back. Everybody fall back. Uh, they are out of range of Eevee now. We'll have Eevee cover their back with Durgatana's cover. While everybody falls back. If we can slow them down just a little bit, it's good. Good. Eevee drove them off. Okay. Ooh, that was a lot of damage. Uh, Eevee just... They're, they're still trying to get through. So Eevee can take them out there. I don't know where Durkatan's going. Okay, we need to capture some people here. So, Laborer, go grab this person. I'm not even going to try and pronounce their name. We got Stingray here. No captures down there. Nice. Damn, Eevee's a killing machine. Alright, that could have gone a lot worse. I'm really glad it didn't. We got attacked by a bunch of gazelle people. We were able to take them out. A couple captures. Uh, somebody's already... Stingray's already in medical emergency. No pulse clinical death. Oh, we shot his heart out. Okay, never mind. Uh, uh, Laborer, go trip him really quickly. Bye, Stingray. Uh, this guy. Extreme pain. Wonder it. Do we care? Uh, we do care about capturing her. Andrew Dan. Dude. Pick up. Tend to Galler per ban. And everybody else is waiting to be treated. Which, a bunch of people went to sleep. Alright, Galloper Band is getting patched up. Good. And then Andrew Dan should move on to the rest of everybody. Okay, excellent. Excellent work, everybody. Psychic Sooth has ended. That's alright. Uh, animals outside are eating up bodies. Why well, he just bit that antelope's head off? I feel like we handled that whole thing pretty well. Could have gone a lot worse. We didn't even lose the sewage outlet. We definitely need to replace this piece of wall, though. Low water temperature. Why? Ah, we ran out of hot water there for a minute because we ran out of water. Dang. Not even irrigating anymore. We're still running out of water. Faceless Dragon lost a left ring finger. Um, I'll, oh, before I forget, before I forget, uh, Durkatan actually needs a new arm since his arm did get shot off. So install steel arm, left shoulder. And he's like a main melee person, so he kind of needs that. This room is just filthy. Like, this is the worst, most... Th this is the dirtiest hospital in existence right now. Uh, we're gonna need to get a heater. We're gonna want... Two high-tech research benches. Let's put them on this wall, yeah. High-tech research benches... Go faster depending on the cleanliness of the area that they are in. Although, we can't do that there because we also need to build the 2x2 two two, uh, multi-analyzer. Install a sword arm, right? So they do need space in between them. Let's just go like this instead. I don't know. We'll figure something out. 
Heaters over here. Now to get lights. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then right in the middle. That should light up the room. Uh, we also need to have space for hospital beds with uh, the the monitor thing, vitals monitor, and TVs pointing at them. It's not the ideal setup in here, but I'm going to enjoy it all the same. Dang. Our artist is just pumping out these, uh, these excellent sculptures, and I love it. Temperature in here is 15C. Could be worse, could be better. I'm not going to worry about it too much. Uh, let's check these guys. They are patched up, so I don't have to worry about them. Okay, Evie. I mean, don't have too much fun without us. They enjoyed their stay. They'll visit again in a while. Uh, left me four herbal medicine, 60 boomalope meat. Nice. And Casey? Casey's major brick. Yep. I need to figure out something to make her mood better. I also think, honestly, I need to be putting down a lot more heaters. I've been kind of avoiding putting heaters in the center, but it is what I need to do. As long as we got components, we'll be okay. And the next time that a ship goes by, we definitely need to be getting components from them. Turn this thing on. The hauling bot can take care of all the clothing. Hospitality is very nearly done. Uh, we want to go look among the beds that we have down here and see if there are any excellent... Uh, those are two excellents, and that looks like it. So we'll move these up, reinstall these in these rooms. Otherwise, we're going to build copy. In every room. These are wood. I'm okay with wood. And then select them and set the quality builder to excellent or better. Let's get some standing lamps. Dusty's on a shoot frenzy. Why? I don't know. Not going to question it. Get that going there, and then we want at least one heater, and then a cooler this way. There we go. Um, it's not going to be putting toilets in the end. Maybe I want to do that. I might want to put toilets in the end of that. Just some small stalls, that way, like, they're not trying to go out and use our toilets. I guess it'll depend on whether... My people are having problems finding an open toilet. Like, we got about, like, 18 people and, like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine toilets. And they seem to be keeping up pretty well. There's nobody waiting. Nobody's been complaining about lack of toilets. One of our rhinos just gave birth. Hey. And flower. Oh god, yeah, that the the, the hauling bot took care of the clothes so quick. I might want to get rid of the Labradors. I've been thinking about it for a while. They were got I got them because of uh, uh easy hauling and like it's not necessary anymore. Also, I should really I I'm trying to think of whether I should kill this spider. Because it's basically there to take care of any vermin that get inside any rats boom rats whatever because they can kill boom rats without without setting them off um but because of the entire defensive setup i don't have those anymore so i don't really know if we need them bandits are spreading I set up another outpost god dang can i just nuke that mountain range really like that
We need cleaning bots. Casey is just working non-stop right now. <laughs> I think I'm going to sell off the Labradors. We don't really need them anymore. We can't even ride them. Um, the spider I will keep. Yeah, Dusty's trying his best right now. As long as they're excellent or better, he will let them go. Uh, awful negative six. I'm going to have to start getting statuary in there too. You know what, let's just... I'm looking at this and like, I want to... I want to set those up as bathroom stalls. I'm also trying to set up this room, really, because I want to start on tailoring, so that my people can stop complaining. Well, specifically so Casey can stop complaining. You want to say something about how the colony is going, but you're afraid Cassandra will hear you? That's a legit worry. That is a legit worry. Remove the bridge there. We're gonna go with the double defensive line. This will be tier one gun defenses. That is basically the plan. Oh no. Oh, blights are really bad, right? Oh my god. God dang it. All right, select all of that. No more, so oh, no sewing at all. Cut everything down. We're gonna have to restart this whole entire farm. God dang. Hi, Dusty. At least we got plenty of food right now. I might need to do some hunting in a while. Uh, let's go get the Ibex. More Ibex here. Some ni nice goat meat. There's a wolf. Looking for anything else that's moving, but now it's nighttime, so they stop moving. Ibex. Hunt you. Oh, and there's a giant spider. Hunt that shit. Yeah, don't let that go. Timberwolf is attacking after being attacked. That's too bad. It's dead now. You're lurking. Lurk all you like, Tiggy. I love me a Tiggy in any form. Did I decide if I wanted this guy or did I just capture him? I didn't even look at him. Undergrounder, not a miner, not a researcher. Physically, psychically hypersensitive, but tough. Melee and cooking. He is not really one that I want. Um, people are in good moods right now, I think. I think we're gonna... Uh, we're gonna take a lung and we're gonna take a kidney. And then we're gonna... Give him some peg legs and let him go. We're going to use him for practice and uh, profit. Uh, the sickle, Crimson Sickle Nation does not like that, but they attacked me first. This is really going to lower their, their, their liking of me. They attacked first, god dang it. Not my fault. It's only slightly my fault. You can't harvest eyes anymore. It's really disappointing because like, I'd really like to because Spoon needs two eyes, but I can't. An agricultural trader, the Indulgent Pigeon Transport. Indulgent Pigeon Transport. Okay, uh, we are going to sell off all of our dogs. It's time. Say bye-bye, everybody, and I don't even care if they're bonded. I care a little bit, but we're getting rid of the dogs. It's time. Say bye-bye.
Doesn't seem like anything else I really want from them. But hey, they take sculptures. Seems like everybody takes sculptures these days. We should be able to harvest everything. I agree. I agree. We can do eye transplants right now, you know? Needless... Oh, that actually affects them now. Needlessly installed peg leg. Uh, builder is hunting. I mean, I'm okay with that. Because the spider's pretty slow. Here, go back here, builder. Get these traps for a reason. Come at me, bro. Oh, God. I did not expect him to actually come at me. Oh, he got him. Okay, he got him. <laughs> he went right through that door. <laughs> okay, well then. I want to take this down, because this is a fire hazard is what this is. I have a normal sculpture. That should be all the rooms. I don't think we have any aesthetics. Why is Evie in a bad mood? Bonded animal sold. Oh, yeah. All right. Well, people are going to be unhappy for a little bit. Uh, we got a lot of people in yellow, one in red. I think it might be time to go use this sucker. Boon, go ahead, activate that. Uh, that, I don't know who that affected. I think it affects everybody. Strange feeling of contentment, yeah. Uh, they want... Oh, there's a collection of beta poly nearby. Too far away for winter. And, oh no, Gutworms is now roaming around the colony. That sucks, but at least we got plenty of food. That's going to make people unhappy, but we use the Psychic Soothe. Could be worse. Oh, hey, uh, this guy's up. Uh, I think it's time to let him go. Bye. Have a safe trip home. We got a bunch of chocolate. Thank you, Cassandra. Cassandra feels bad about all the things that she just did, so she gave us some chocolate. Bye. Bye. Have fun. We even left him with his parka. It only took, like, 12 away. <laughs> okay, as for here, we're going to grant it up this wall. Does chocolate expire? question. Nope. It can deteriorate. Okay, so in here we're going to go for hygiene, bone, everything. I don't think I'm going to give them bathtubs, just showers. Select the bone base, and there we go. How many pipes? Yeah, I should not do that. There we go. We'll do like this way. I don't know why I feel the need to consolidate what I'm doing, but I do. Like, it's not like we're going to run out of bone anytime soon. What was that? Random bone everywhere. <coughs> oh, they had just put slightly small things in there. Okay, fine.
It's really sanitary to have sewage outlet right next to the medical bay. I know. I know. It but it, it kind of it it's we don't need intake and outtake pipes. And it kind of bugs me that we don't, but at the same time, I'm I'm grateful for it. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, we're gonna have sewage outlet right here. We'll destroy it right there and we'll have water pumps over here, I'm assuming. We'll see how this works out. With some bone plumbing going through the... Uh, no. Down that away and then coming up here. I don't want exposed plumbing because that could cause a lot of problems. Like, there is a contamination thing, but it's only in contaminated water, so I don't think it's something I have to worry about. Is it the... It's the women's sink now. Who is doing that? Yeah, nobody minds the uh, pipes made out of bones. Why are you in pain? Oh, gut worms. Uh, where's the paradigm? We had paradigm. Where is the paradigm? There it is. It's in paradigm. Oh, is that it? It's your hairballs, Evie. Makes much sense as anything else. Oh, a conceptual artist named, Ch named Chisk calls from nearby. She is being chased by tribespeople from the kinship of the Lonesome Warhammer, which we could take out. Seven archers, one berserker chief, two berserkers, eight heavy archers, ten hunters, three warriors. Holy crap, that's a lot of people. 40 years old, conceptual artist. I'm leaning towards yes, what do you guys think? This is a big fight. <laughs> That's a big fight. Yeah. All right, Chisk. Come on in. First off, we're going to shut off the hauling bot. And then we need everybody to get ready to get to position. Chisk, I don't know if we're going to be able to get you a gun. You are a great artist. You're a transhumanist, nimble, and a psychopath. You're actually really good. You're actually really good. All right. Here they come. Here I go killing again. Ooh, they're attacking immediately. That's a lot of people. And they're elephant people. All right, Digger. Chisk here. We're going to try and lure them through everything, but chances are because our defenses aren't set up completely yet, they might not go for it. God, look at all of them. Cancel that so they don't go try and destroy that. Colonists bother if they eat elephant mate. Uh, if it's elephant man meat, yes. Alright, they're coming in. Uh, we are... Yeah, Dusty needs a new spot. Digger needs a spot. They're hitting the traps. They're attacking the door, though. Oh, well, they stopped. The traps are taking their toll. Perfect. They're about to get through. Welcome to the Thunderdome, bitch! <laughs> well, Chisk actually got hit. I hit pretty hard, too. All right, guys. Um, wish Evie was mounted. He's not. They're attacking doors. They are attacking that door. Stop that. Stop that. All right, everybody. You're free to go. Uh, except for Evie. Evie, Evie, Evie.
What if you can make entrapment if they come in, they do not come out? Any ideas? Uh, you can do things like that, yeah. Um, let's grab some of the doctors, start capturing people, VIP, minor. They actually got some captures from the traps there, but I, I need them to stop doing that. Oh, they appear to be giving up. Oh, Evie knocked him down and dead. Nice. Evie took a shot there, but it's okay. All right. So Chisk here is going to be renamed first off V Artist. Um, and again, if anybody would like to uh, claim a colonist, all you got to do is call it out. She is a transhuman nimble psychopath. I love all of that. There's a lot of stuff she can do. She can also craft, but she's going to be main artist. Oh yeah, we definitely need more beds. We definitely need more beds, which I have been working on. And we also need to reactivate this. Where is he? Did he never get activated? It says the bot appears. Oh, and yep. <clears throat> called it. They destroyed that thing. So we got to reset the pipes as soon as possible. He was a good murder kitty. Let's get Dusty up to just focus on this. It needs to be done. Um, they are being patched up. Excellent. Right now, nobody can use the bathroom, though, and I think they could be upset about that. Just a, just a hunch. Thomas needs rescue. She don't have a bed. Uh, no, it's hypothermia. Um, wait, we have more beds. Like, we've got more beds here that they can use temporarily. I'm not using them. I gotta keep an eye on Dusty or he's gonna go to sleep. Ordening. I don't know. Focus. I really miss the uh, work until complete that used to be in here. And cannot work, needs steel. Oh, we're out of steel. Oh, that's bad. Huh. Is there any steel I can still grab out here? Marble. Oh, no. Ha ha ha. Little tiny bit of steel left. Very tiny bit of steel left. Um until that is done, we actually do need to set up temporary latrines. Like, we're still able to use a little bit of uh, of our stored water, and we're still storing water, so we can still wash our hands and everything, we just don't have latrines. So once Dusty's done with his meal... Work on that. Yeah, I guess. It's a priority to get after the current current research. I want to get these bodies in. Good, good, good. Taking those down. 
Eevee's a major break risk because uh, his bonded animal is sold. Alright, though. And we need to allow sewing in there again now that everything is chopped down. Dusty builds a wooden box proceeds to, proceeds to immediately shit in it. Well, yes, that's how it works. Builder is on a shooting spree, or insulting spree, not shooting spree. Uh, because we butchered human-like. Well, it, they attacked us first. I mean, that's no excuse. Very poor excuse. Oh no. Stop that. We we use that steel on not not the not the outlet. Shit. No, and they did destroy the door, you bastards. Oh, I can't afford the steel to go in there. You gotta make sure it's working. What are you doing, Kagari? <sighs> Stop. I forgot that those take steel, too! No! Stop! <laughs> that, 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 that. Stop. This only needs 50 steel. We're almost there, guys. Come on. We'll remove that flooring. Use what little still we have left to be able to go poop. Please. Everybody's running in here to go to the bathroom. <laughs> Alright, once Kibble gets working on the bodies... Start working on those. Let's look at the tribals that we just got. We've got annoying voice underground fast walker. Uh, plants fast walker. Uh, a plants with fast walker is very good, but he doesn't have any good other skills that I might want to utilize. Sanguine is nice, creepy breathing, so he wouldn't care about being insulted. Durkatan is throwing a tantrum because of his unsightly environment. What? And there's a flash storm during the winter. I don't. I don't really mind that during the winter. Can't you melt weapons? Yeah, I don't have a smelter yet to do that. An iguana here is an undergrounder psychopath with plant skill and mining. So this guy's got no negatives and he has plant skill and a psychopath. I'm, uh, I'm gonna say that guy. Need a farmer. What's wrong with her? The gut worms, that's right. We need to stop using... Yeah, a bunch of people were still using better than herbal and we're just wasting medicine at this point. Okay, we got all that. Dusty, please, please, please work on the sewage outlet. Man, we really need a cleaning bot. <laughs> Somebody is starving? What? Oh. Gut worms. Go, Dusty, go! Yeah! Alright. Good. St wait. That's not... Did we actually destroy some plumbing somewhere? No, it's still attached. Ah, we did. Apparently some did get destroyed. And we can, uh... Deconstruct these now. What I also want to look at is possibly... Is it a water well that we would put there? Yeah. We would need more steel for that, though. Look at that pure white mega sloth. That's pretty. And apparently it's it's partner thinks so over there.
Okay, so in here we want to set up uh, some bridges. That is going to protect this thing. We're going to basically surround this thing with more granite wall. So all the stuff will get washed away, but it will be protected against people who are coming in. I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. Well, we'll go a little bit closer. Bridge there. Uh, that is one, two, three, four by four. We'll have a water pump right there. Hunter's Lodge, you're invited to the Pact of the Leaping Mace's Chief Summer Retreat. It's not summer. There's usually a large herd of spellopedes coming through around this time of year. There's an outpost at the site with all the required facilities to make meals, and they've extended their hospitality to you. The offer expires in 23 days. I guess that means that, like, I'd go out there and I'd come back with a lot of meat? That's what I'm guessing that means. Uh, caravan request for a 380 bear skin. I don't have it. I don't know what that was. We are just having tons of major break risks right now. So this is the filthiest room in the world. But that's okay. Oh, a solar flare is bad in the winter on the other hand. I don't like that at all. Need to watch the temperature in this room specifically. Like my people can put up with the bad moods, the chickens cannot put up with bad with bad, with a lot of cold. Uh, so really quickly, we need to get some campfires going. It might not. It might last more than a day. It might last a few hours. I don't know, but uh, we need to make sure the chickens don't freeze to death. Also, we're doing pretty well. A lot of things right now. We ran out of kibble, so that sucks. Uh, we're also out of grass. I'll have to watch for animal starvation. Yeah, all of them are starving. I don't. Actually, let's check the... Oh, wow. Yeah, let's let's get rid of some, some chickens here. I want to keep the one rooster. But any other males can go. We only need, need one ever. In fact, we might want to go with a younger rooster. We'll go with a younger rooster. Rooster four here. The males will go. And that should be good for now. Uh, we want about eight females. One, two... Three, four, five, six, seven, nine. We can go for nine. <clears throat> nope, nope, all the rooms have uh, stuff in them. Cool. here and we will start on the bedrooms in just a moment solar flare is really lasting though here we go let's go get some hunting in or waiting hey a bear Eh, I don't care about the bear. I'm gonna hunt down the Megas Loss. I will hunt down the bear too. We got rhinos. We got rhinos, it's okay. Solar Flare has ended. Good. It does seem like we did not need the campfires, but I'm glad that we had them anyway, just in case. Better safe than sorry. Turn that on for the hauling bot. You can take care of the clothing really soon. These are getting done. 
which is excellent. We have a lot of major break risks. I do not like the major break risks that we have. Moods are pretty low right now. It's not a mood spiral, which is my biggest worry. I ne you, you, you never want a mood spiral. Uh, on the other hand, uh, animals starving to death is also bad, so maybe I do want to let them in to here. Alright, what area are you in? Animal allowed. Yeah, we need to let them in. Kitchens. I didn't want to let them into the kitchens. Oh well. Outside of getting steel off of Mountain's Deep Drilling and Merchant Selling, that's it. Pretty much. I can send a caravan out, something like that, you know. A mega sloth is hunting me! Oh no! Builder is terrified, I'm sure. I mean, I can smelt it, but I don't have a smelting table. Or I even... Nope, I have the electric smelter. It just takes 170 steel to build. So I might have to wait for a caravan or a trade ship to go by. Like, we got the we got the most important thing, which is the sewage outlet. We can wait a little bit. Uh, artist is sleeping in there. Damn. It's gonna be cold as heck in there. Lots of major break risks. Okay. What do we need to do? Bought an animal sold. Someone's organ harvested. Slept in the cold. Huntress is just really unhappy. Wow. And it's the organ harvesting that really did it. So, Miner, I'm going to stake you. Since you got that negative 17, it's going to go away in like one day. We're going to give you... Do we have any smoke leaf? We do. We have just enough smoke leaf for you... Uh, for Eevee, we're going to get some catnap, and Huntress, you get some as well. A lot of human meat and a lot of kibble. Good. Uh, let's make it so the kibble does not get stored in here. It does not get stored in here. They're just dropping him. Uh, the hauling bot will take it out of here, but now that we have kibble, I definitely want to make it so that the animals do not go in here. Get out. You will have kibble soon once the hauling bot gets to it. There is no room in that room for kibble. That's unfortunate. So we're going to destroy the zone here. And I'm going to make a new zone. Specifically for kibble. And... Fertilized eggs. Diplomatic marriage. No, I do not do diplomatic marriages. Piss off. Alright, get that out of there. Feed the chickens. What do you mean no storage space? I just made... Because that stuff's in the way. Huh. Alright. Um... Secondary stockpile here. Copy. Paste. And let's go. Oh. And let's get rid of all of this stuff that is taking up room. We do have visitors. A group of the Loyal Jungle Tree. Hi, guys. I don't need any more colonists right now. A little uh, worried because it's winter. A little bit out of food. So we're going to halt. We're going to wait. We did lose a single chicken. Oh, two chickens, wow. Oh no, those are the roosters that I had to kill off, that's right. There we go. There we go. And a muffalo is starving? Excuse me. More muffalos could starve. There's a bush right there, why doesn't he go eat the bush? I definitely need to keep them out of the gardens, though. I keep letting them in the gardens, they're going to eat me out of house and home. So we need to stop them from going in there. So we got Kenda, uh, Pyromaniac, Annoying Voice Volatile, wow, you were just all kinds of bad. 
Quick Sleeper, Psychically Deaf Undergrounder. That's all good. Those are all positive traits, but she's nothing that I need. And Dark Light, Hard Worker, Chemical Fascination, though. I wanted to avoid Chemical Fascination as much as I possibly can. Hey, Eclipsite. How about you Butcher right now? Oh, we're going to go through that kibble so fast. I wish there was a way that I could make it so only the chickens ate kibble. But, I mean, every animal needs to be eating kibble and hay right now. Um, Might want to get rid of the muffalo calves. Let's go see if our guests want them. When they wake up. Hey, Kenda. Come here. Talk to me. Let's make friends. Get her, Kagari! Just running off. Okay, uh, they do not, but they will take a bunch of the extra weapons that we have. Eh, I'll sell that one too. Kinda crappy, crappy quality anyway. But after that attack, we have so much stuff to sell. Uh, they have nothing I want. Kind of a worthless trap, you just think. I agree. Give me your little bit of silver and then leave. I mean, tell your friends, but get out. Start taking uh, these up in the quality of these rooms. Although I did want to see, I think it's been Miner. Oh, the artist is working on it right now. I think Miner also was. Oh, wow, look at that artistry skill. 17. So Kagari is working on charming them, not recruiting, just charming. It is the 15th of August. It has gotten warm enough outside that we're now raining, which is good. Why are you in such a bad mood? You are still upset that you were insulted? You're still angry about that. Uh, there is no more smoke leaf left for you, buddy. Oh, well, you're gonna go on a cat dip binge then. Wow. Do you have any rivals? That is a good question. Um, you, uh, come can veteran mouse. Uh, which is the kinship of the lonesome warhammer. Spoon and Digger aren't friends with you, but they're not rivals. I just realized that I can't do this because that requires a bunch of steel. I'm like, why aren't they getting this done? Yeah, I'm thinking Smelter. Smelter and uh, all that is our next is our next goal. Derek Dan just has a lot of work cut out for him getting those bricks. That's all. Uh, in the meantime, do I want to really stretch out a whole thing from there? And just stretch that downwards? And if so, how far do I want to stretch it? But we are at the beginning of the spring, and with spring, we are actually ending this episode. I hope you all enjoyed. If you did, make sure to like and hit that subscribe button. Make sure to comment if you like one of my colonists. Uh, we've got, so far, we got Kibble, uh, Miner, Laborer, Huntress, Digger, Artist. we got a lot of people that need to be claimed. I'm Omni Rusted. You've been awesome. I'll see you next time. Mm -hmm.